In today's video, I'll be sharing an email from Home Office regarding why your certificate of sponsorship, which is your COS, has been delayed for a long time. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Fadira. If you're joining me for the very first time, I'm so happy to have you all in our beautiful family. For my returning subscribers, thank you very much for coming back to watch my videos. I really do appreciate. If you're new to this channel, I create content on how you can migrate to the UK, UK immigration updates, life in the UK, scholarship in the UK, everything you can think about the uk so if you're someone who is interested in such content do hit on the subscribe button turn on the notification bell so each time i upload a new video you're definitely going to be the very first person to see that video so guys let's quickly dive right into today's video please do like and share this video with your friends and loved ones this may just help somebody recently i've been getting a lot of messages especially if you go through my comment section and also in my inbox in my emails everywhere that their COS have been delayed by the organization that have employed them guys i would say calm down like i earlier mentioned i'm going to be sharing an email sent from home office to an employer regarding the delays now there are some organizations that just apply for their COS and immediately the home office approves it there are some that it stays for a longer time because maybe the home office is trying to review to see why this organization is actually applying for more COS or maybe applying for COS for the very first time so now if you have been waiting for your COS and your employer have told you wait we are still waiting to get from home office guys I would advise you wait because no matter the amount of calls or the emails you send to your organization if they have not gotten any feedback from home office they will not be able to issue you a certificate of sponsorship to be able to apply for your visa so once the organization have said calm down we are waiting to hear from the home office I know it's not really easy to wait but at the same time there is nothing they can do from there because the only time this US can be allocated or assigned to you is when home office have approved it to the employer so if they don't approve it there's no amount of calls and messages or emails or any which way you have been contacting your employer there's no amount of thing you're going to do that will make this us to come at if they have not heard from uk home office now a lot of people have asked me fabira how long does this us takes for the home office to approve it now some us is like i said could take just one day some could take up to 60 days some could take up to 28 days it depends on home office and this is a situation where the employer cannot do anything the only thing the employer can do maybe is to email home office to find out why it's delaying and maybe the home office will get back to them which is one of the email i'm just going to share with you in this video as an employer emailed home office to find out what is going on because he has applied for his cos for a long time and it's has not been allocated and this is not just from one employer I have gotten similar messages from a lot of employers especially when I get in touch with them so just as you can see this is an email from home office after the employer has emailed home office because this employer applied I think almost two weeks now and he has not heard anything from home office and some of the messages I have been getting recently regarding the delay of COS from my beautiful subscribers are those who have been waiting between April and May. So just to let you know that we've had so many bank holidays between April, I think we had the Easter bank holiday and in May we've had other bank holidays also with the King's coronation. So this has impacted the processing time of maybe your visa or your certificate of sponsorship if you're still waiting for it. So like I said, this is a reply from UK Home Office, which I'm also going to leave on the screen for you to see. And also, I'm going to read it for you to also hear what the Home Office has sent to an employer. So just as you can see, um, delay of course. Dear sir, thank you for the email below because this employer has already emailed Home Office to find out why it's taking so long. The service standard for receiving a decision on an application is one working day in straightforward cases. Where the case working team need further information, they will write to the sponsor on receipt of the requested information. The case working team have 20 working days to consider the case. We are currently experiencing an unusual high volume of applications, which we are working through in dates order with a view to make decisions as early as possible. Fortunately, because of these volumes, 
occasionally decision may unavoidably take longer than we would like we apologize for the inconveniences this has caused there is no recourse to an administrative review for a decision made on a defined cos application you can submit another application at any time however you must ensure that your application meets all the criteria outlined in the sponsor guidance and the job meets all of the criteria outlined in the code of practice before submitting the application so this is a response to an employer who has already applied for cos and is still waiting for the home office to get back to him and this is what the home office replied in when he email the home office to find out what is happening another reason why your series is delayed is that a lot of new companies have been licensed to sponsor from overseas so check the license sponsored list it is updated on daily basis like if you even check today you see that it was updated maybe yesterday or maybe today so more companies are being added to that list and once they are being added to that list they also apply for CRS to sponsor their employees from overseas or those in the UK to come to the UK and work so now because a lot of companies are being added on the license sponsored list it is also for that delay your COS. So guys, what I would say, just calm down and just make sure that you're currently in touch with the organization that is sponsoring you. Send an email just to remind them that you're also still waiting and that's it. The best your employer can do is just to email home office, which some of the employers I know have done and they also got similar feedback. So guys, this is just what it is. Be calm, be patient and at the same time, just uh, pray about it and I believe your COS will be out. But bear in mind, like I said, that we've had so many bank holidays. So guys, we've actually come to the end of this video and I hope you find this video helpful. And if you do, do hit on the subscribe button, turn on the notification bell. So each time I upload a new video, you're definitely going to be the very first person to see that video. Also do like and share this video with your friends and loved ones. It may help somebody panicking or somebody who is worried about the cos so until i see you in my next video guys do take care and have a lovely day thank you for watching and bye bye for now